on Office 365, uh, which is Microsoft Office 365 basic training, where we will undergo the day one part where we will discuss on the basics of Office Microsoft Office 365, where it comes to uh, Microsoft Outlook, one, Microsoft OneDrive, Microsoft Word, Microsoft Excel, and Microsoft PowerPoint. So, basis on this, we will discuss on these things like how we can manage this Office 365 environment for multiple users. So, for these guys, uh, first we will need the organization profiles. So, organization profile guys uh, means uh, we need something to manage it. It means like uh, suppose a uh, Microsoft we have a corporation. So, Microsoft uh, it's, it's, it's a ten uh, which is a specific organization which is uh, providing this. Uh, manage the organization level settings so that users in the uh, can manage the OneDrive like uh, where we have to manage the storage part okay which we will discuss in detail like how the storage will be managed now next thing uh, how these services will get lined up okay so for this how to interact with this OneDrive and uh, other services like uh, the backup part also for those services okay so for this a tenant is needed tenants means a uh, we can say it's a for a landlord and second is tenant so landlord we can say which is microsoft which is which he will be responsible for provisioning the subscription okay so basically tenant uh, we can say any other third organization suppose i am running any my company anything uh, like uh, so, so suppose my organization name is xyz so I have taken a subscription or taken a, a plan for uh, managing uh, it through Microsoft. So Microsoft will uh, give us a different uh, subscription basis on it. This organization means this is our organization. Now basis with which is XYZ, it's an organization. So basis on this, uh, what Microsoft will do? Microsoft will provide us uh, a one-time fee for managing those you managing the services which is interlinked with this uh, services part okay manage services means one-time fee it can be a uh, like we can say it's a 200 dollar fee for uh, free users which uh, microsoft will provide for managing those uh, uh, two managing the services or working on the workloads which is a one-time fee which microsoft means after that it will get uh, credited means so not uh, 200 dollar 100 dollar okay so likewise and pay as you go model also will be there okay means what pay as you go model means uh, after utilizing this free plan of uh, 100 dollar credit you can avail the services means after that microsoft will charge you uh, money for uh, availing the other services now talking about the services part guys so how the services can be managed these services can be managed by means of a configuration means list of services you can use here as i have told like uh, onedrive is one of the service we would be should be utilizing to manage the file transfer okay and the second thing which you can say for uh, managing these users is in tune we can enroll those users into by managing by mobile device management okay so likewise uh, we can manage those users in uh, in tune and utilizing these services uh, for tenant so this is guys our part one for uh, managing the uh, office 365 uh, uh, subscriptions and tenant configuration so tenant configuration will be also will be discussing in detail uh, but uh, as if no you can remember that tenant means uh, we can, it is paying for rent like uh, paying money for utilize using those services okay uh, which can be a pay as you go model means as soon as you use the services suppose i am using uh, uh, three out of two services i am using okay guys so so for this what it would charge for two services only okay and how much use you will do for that two services okay that two service suppose you are using it for uh, one month okay so that charge will be availing it for one month only and thereafter you can uh, stop that plan also okay so that we will discuss in later videos so this is day one of our starting
माइक्रोसॉफ्ट ऑफिस थ्री सिक्सटी फाइव एडमिन थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग